In this video, I'm going to show you how to use Photoshop CC droplets to convert multiple pictures from RGB mode to grayscale mode. This isn't just how to make your pictures look grayscale, but to actually convert all of your pictures to grayscale RGB 8-bit. That way you can do things without color in them. This is pretty easy, but there are a couple of gotchas. As you can see here, I've got this picture open with color in it and I need to get rid of it. You can see I've got my convert to grayscale action and I'm going to show you how to do that. First you need to open the actions window and that is under window and actions. If you've never recorded an action before you're in for a real treat. Under the action window you simply click plus and you give it a name convert grayscale test because I've already got one and then you click record. Now what Photoshop will do is it will record all of your clicks and it will help you out. First what you do is you go to edit, or sorry, image, mode, and grayscale. Are you sure you want to discard the color information? Yes, we want to discard the color information. The next thing you do is go to file, save, and then make it 10 or whatever you need to do hit OK, and then all you do is close the window, and then you're done. Hit stop in the actions menu. There's no time immediacy in the actions window, so if it takes you a while to figure it out or pause, you can restart, and it's real easy. Now that we've created this action, all we're going to do is create a Photoshop droplet to automate this entire process. To do that, go to File, scroll down to Automate, and Create Droplet. You're literally going to create a program in Photoshop to be put on your computer to use wherever you want. I'm going to choose my grayscale to convert to black and white, and I'm going to call this Convert to Grayscale App. Don't mess with the app icon, or the app extension. Hit Save. And the destination, this is key, is default actions or wherever you saved your action to. And then choose your action, convert to grayscale test. Don't do anything else with these checkboxes. And then destination, save and close. And this is the trick, override actions save as commands. Now hit OK. And then now, in my finder here, you'll see I've got my grayscale picture and all my other pictures are grayscale, but you'll see this convert to grayscale app. Now all I have to do is click and drag a picture onto it and voila, the picture is converted to grayscale. Now if you want to do bulk, let's say I need to do the entire folder super quick, you have to have Photoshop open for it to run quickly is click and drag every picture onto there and super quick Photoshop will automatically convert all of your pictures to grayscale for you in the background. It only takes a few seconds and it's like you literally sat there and clicked Photoshop for an hour and a half while you're sitting back and enjoying your coffee. And as Photoshop is done, now all of my pictures are grayscale and I can confirm this for you by taking the picture dropping it into Photoshop and you can see in the upper left hand corner it says gray 8 we'll also confirm this with image mode and grayscale and that is how you convert your images to grayscale RGB 8-bit grayscale super quickly using Photoshop CC droplets and you can use this anywhere on your computer. It is super powerful. My name is Aaron Linsdow. I'm a digital arts teacher. Check out my other Photoshop links below to help you out. And also check out my Udemy classes link below as well. Please like and comment on the video and subscribe to the channel. Thank you very much and enjoy your grayscale.